What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. I'm Andy the Middle Aged Gamer and this is another super special unboxing for you guys. Now, this is the officially licensed 2024 batch VFC SCAR 17H GBBR. Now, this being the Asia edition should come with complete markings and being the 2024 batch should hopefully have a few little tweaks to the bolt carrier and have an M-Pass. Now, while I get this open and let's jump in and get this thing done. Oh, while I do, let's put disclosures on screen right now. Let's carry on. Okay, so as you can see, you get your usual typical crappy packaging. There we go. And as always, it is just an absolute nightmare to get these straps off. There we go, let's get one out of the way. Pull that one out of the way. Now, I got this from Action Airsoft because basically they were the ones who confirmed that they had the 2024 batch at the time when I contacted WGC two months ago. They only had the older 2022 batch, if I remember rightly, and they said theirs didn't have an MPAS. So, of course, you're going to go with the one that says yes. Now, looks like we're opening it from one end. So, well, what happens? I'm going to lift this up. Now, of course, this has gone through... I, about a month and a half nearly since I ordered it to get here through EMS Speedship. So, yeah, another reason why I prefer UPS. I would have had this within a week of ordering it. But because they don't use that, there's not really much we can do. Now, I know you can't see much, but I'm just taking out the ends. And there we have the box. Oh. Okay. This is one big box. Is that everything? Yep. Now, I did actually order it with two extra mags. Let's yeet that out of the way. Oops. I'll clean that up again later. Just throw them over there while I can. So, hopefully, they did put that in. Yes. As you can see, this has all the official markings. And, ooh, someone's had a, a nasty bump on transit. So, the usual. Like I say, got a few dings in the box. To be expected when it comes from uh, Taiwan and through EMS, because to be honest with you, the company that handles EMS to the UK is Parcel Force, and they're not exactly known for their uh, quality in delivery. They're just known for adding extra charges. Right, okay. Right, I think you guys can see that. You've got your FN Herstal on the front and on the at sides, it says it basically all the way around. So let's. You ready, guys? Let's have a look. Okay. Now, like I said, this is supposed to have two extra mags in it. You've got your manual speed loader in there. Got one magazine here. We've got the rifle in it back here. I just want to check because, yep. Yes! They did, they shoved them under. As you can see, we've got two extra mags here. You're gonna need it. Let's move down a second. Yeah, so we've done a nice job in uh, safely packing it. This has got some absolute nice weight to it as well. It doesn't feel so chintzy. But uh, yeah, unlike Bada Bing though, I'm not so lucky. And as always, they do put charges on there. It's very rare, you generally have to call that your lottery moment in life when you uh, don't pay charges because that means that the, how would say, the HMRC was not doing their job properly that day. And if they find out, well, they'll just end up putting the charges in the post to you. They're that evil. We don't need that one. Okay. So, of course, yes, they have. Let's just cut all that rubbish off. Easy enough, it's only cellophane. It's easy enough to get rid of. Oh dear me. So as you can see, we're taking this off. And yes, we do have the actual markings. It's not like the uh, very rare UK ones because it, this being the scar from BSC, and everyone likes it, but they only make a handful every one or two years. Now, the last one was apparently in 2023 when they changed the bolt carrier group to the m and just added a little bit more weight to it, I believe, from what I've heard. I will do the uh, due diligence there and confirm that later. 
But uh, that's my knife. Can't be bothered ripping my hands up anymore. Just to get that. Okay. I mean, really? This is just overkill, right, guys? Right, so it's in save. Ooh, that's a nice meaty bolt. So, you do get your folding stock, adjustable cheat well, and obviously you've got your usual button here, which this one goes out and all the way in. Now, the safe is in that, so. Fun mode, semi, safe. Nice, weighty, heavy trigger to it. But yeah, lock your bolt to the rear. Let's check both sides. Got a nice bit of grease. Drop that bolt for you. Ooh. Yeah, your hop is down there. And of course we should, if I, yeah, let's do the sides first. So here we have a button. We just sort of like flip up. And of course, turn that all the way and you get your tool to adjust your hop and you can put it back into its usual. And you get your rear front and rear sight. That's nice. Like well, when it was released there, it's ambidextrous as well, so that's nice. But yeah, apart from all the shipping grease and oil, this looks really good. It's nice and light actually. Comparing it to like the 416, this is actually quite light. Now let's take a look at the magazine. Oi. Had no gas there, but they will be gas in it. Give me two seconds. One. That should be enough to just do a proof of cycling test, won't it, guys? Now, of course, these do come with the dry fire switch. So you can switch down, put it into dry fire mode. We'll leave it with the bolt lock. Why not? So. Okay. Yep, that's in. Locks to the rear. Whoa, that's nice. Nice. Okay, that's nice. And the mag goes in quite smoothly, just wearing in. Okay, so what do you think, guys? Let's get rid of all this crap out of the way. I absolutely am excited to get this tested. Ever since I had the 417, I like the big ball rifles and to have a SCAR 17. For me in this channel, it's there basically so I can compare it for when the Guns Modify MWS SCAR L, I believe, is coming out. So it'd be nice something to compare it to in the SCAR model. And I can't wait to get this outside on the range and putting it through its full review. So stay tuned for that. Please, as always, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.